All right, good evening from Abu Dhabi. I've just arrived here and I'm back in the same hotel, the Al Ain Palace Hotel, a hotel I'm actually pretty satisfied with. It has decent prices, decent rooms, all amenities you need, and a very nice pool that you can use, which is of the Meridian Hotel next door. A heated outside pool, so it's actually wonderful. There's my lovely room for next two nights. After which I will fly to Kuwait, a country I've never been before. I'm quite curious to see it. And that will mark my 50th country in my, well, my 30th year of life on this beautiful planet. So, good morning from Abu Dhabi again. I'm at the same hotel, the Al Ain Palace Hotel, which has a shared pool with the Royal Meridian hotel right here. Pool's glorious especially for me because it's in the shade in the morning when the sun is behind that tower and I can just swim without worrying about uh, burning or getting sun sunburn let's say. Um, so it's perfect for me because I burn quite fast. So tomorrow I'll be flying off to Kuwait and I'll be spending three days there. Then I have to Bahrain, which I made an impulse decision yesterday. So it will not be a wizard only trip. I'll be in Bahrain for another three days and then back in Abu Dhabi. It will be an interesting trip. Right, what do you do in the United Arab Emirates when it's really hot? You go to the mall and enjoy some air-conditioned coffee sipping, walking around, shopping, uh, getting your nails done, whatever suits your needs, uh, you can do it all. So I'm here at the Galleria Mall, which is an incredibly big building. And um, I'm here at the waterfront right now, which is just right outside. Um, so the, this is not the actual mall, it's behind this building and I'm just going to pan around show you just the size of this immense city of Abu Dhabi makes me think of Miami a bit in terms of city structure so you have these these uh, districts in the city and then they have water in between uh, connected by these huge highway bridges and all in between is just these walkways along the water just stunning lined with palm trees and all around the shopping malls and modern towers and the city is just if you look at a map it's just tens and tens of kilometers on it the mall is actually right behind there in the middle it's just way too big to capture it all on camera right now and the shopping center the galleria mall is definitely the most impressive mall i've ever seen so far no, i haven't seen that much of the middle east um, it stretches on and on and on, just, just incredible. It's actually not that hot anymore, it's because of the wind. Um, I did have a swim this morning in the swimming pool of the hotel, but I think it was the last time of swimming uh, yesterday in Oman. Right here it's a bit more chilly. Although, I might just need to find a beach and then I'll probably just jump in again. It's summer and winter right now for me. This is the Abu Dhabi mall, which might be one of the bigger ones. I'm not sure if it's the oldest one in the city. Well, it's quite nice, it has all the luxurious brands. It is quite uh, flashy. You can see that everything is blinking, sparking clean. Um, and I'm not really buying anything because the prices are quite steep. I saw rings that I bought in Oman for, what was it, like uh, 10 euros? They cost like 1,500 here just your ordinary silver ring with a stone. Uh, 
um, rides are quite steep but worth the uh, walking around and seeing I guess last evening here in Abu Dhabi gonna have some Indian food I suppose here in this restaurant and it's time for dinner Uh, some spicy beef, some bread. Um, quite hungry, gonna enjoy this. Alright, so I'm here in Abu Dhabi, off to my next destination soon, which is Kuwait. So I've just exchanged my uh, United Arab Emirates dirhams to Kuwait dinars right here. Nice and colorful money. I look forward to exploring my next country. I'll catch you in Kuwait. Alright, ready to leave for Kuwait.